new vaccine mandate is for students who will be starting 7th and 12th grades this fall. These students must have a whooping cough, also known as the Tdap booster, and a meningitis vaccine to enter school. Health officials say it's all about public safety as these diseases have not gone away. Last year, in 2011, were record high number of cases of whooping cough in the United States. And the ones who are susceptible are those of us who haven't had a booster shot recently. Because once you're five and you enter kindergarten, your immunity wanes or fades. And about six to 10 years after your last shot, you are susceptible, meaning you can get pertussis again. So here are the new rules. Seventh graders are required to get a Tdap booster and the first dose of the meningitis vaccine. Twelfth graders must show proof that they've had the Tdap booster and get a second meningitis booster. You can get the vaccines from your child's pediatrician or from your local health department. There are some other vaccines for this age that are recommended that are not mandated by the schools, but it's a good time to review do you need a second shot for chicken pox? If you've only had one chicken pox, you need a booster. Um, the HPV, human papillomavirus, is now recommended for both males and females. Good time to talk with your provider um, about prevention with those as well. The best time to get your child immunized is now. With the new state mandates, doctor's offices will be very busy in July and August, just before the start of the new school year. In Morgantown for the WVU Health Report, I'm Dr. Raleigh Sullivan.